hey guys welcome back to the channel so in today's video i will share with you guys a period day in my life if you are new to my channel please do well to subscribe and like and share this video let's dive right into it yeah. guys i know i am not the only one that think periods are stressful and annoying <laughs> on this particular day i got my period around 3 a.m and i had to like bathe and i had to uh, put on some pads and i think it was around 9 a.m at this particular time so i woke up really late and i had to put in my period day in my flow app i always try to use the flow app to monitor my period and all of that so periods can be very very annoying like <laughs> i'm not even joking i know i am not the only one that feels the same way so i already took my shower around 3 or let's say 3 30 so this is around 9 a.m and i'm just starting my day whenever i'm on my periods i tend to have serious cramps and i got this ginger and honey drink um less than a month ago and i really wanted to try it out to see if it was going to help with my period because ginger is really good for periods so i had it tends to help the period blood flow out more so i wanted to try it out and see if it if it was going to help me out and i drank it and i felt a little bit better but not really like it was just I felt a little bit better anyways guys i went to the store and i took some of the things i was going to use for my period i took my tissue paper my pocket tissue and also some wipes because these are things that i use on my periods and then i went ahead to take another shower because i took a shower around like 3 30 a.m and i'm taking another shower now guys whenever you're you are on your period you have to make sure you are taking constant showers because for me i tend to like have this um smell so i tend to like have odor so i just try to like take a shower as frequently as i can So I am out of the shower now and I want to put on some pads. So I use this one. I think this is an always pad. Um, the packaging of this pad is a pink one, not the blue always. This one is a pink one. And I always try to use cotton panties whenever I am on my period because it makes me feel comfortable. So yeah, guys, always try to use cotton panties whenever you are on your period. And make sure you stick your pad to your panties well so you don't get stained. guys at this point i was still having serious serious cramps that means the ginger and the honey tea i took earlier did not work and recently i've been trying to reduce the way i take painkillers for periods i just tried to like look for methods that can ease my pain instead of taking painkillers because i feel like they have terrible after effects so i went on youtube and i saw this video on how to make eating pads and you would need rice and socks so you put some rice in your socks and you throw it in the microwave and when it is hot you put it on the places where you're having cramps and it will help you and guys when i tell you that this thing worked i was so surprised that it actually works and the funny thing is that you can actually cook your rice again okay you don't have to throw your eyes after this so i put the socks i put the warm socks on my stomach and it really really helped with the cramps i felt better after doing this
whenever I'm in my period, I always have serious, serious cravings. And I was craving jollof spaghetti, but I did not have the strength to make jollof spaghetti. So I had stew. I just had to like boil some spaghetti and eat it with stew. <laughs> I was also craving a mixture of malt and milk. I just had to satisfy my craving, so I mixed malt and milk together. I used to hear from people that it actually gives energy, but I don't think it is true because I drank this and I wanted to go and sleep immediately. <laughs> So guys, before I end this video, I wanted to show you guys how you can make your own period kit at home. Whenever I am on my period, I always go out with my big bag. Like I don't like going out with a small bag where I will not be able to fit in things. So I put my ibuprofen in my bag. I'm not really sure I'm going to use it, but I just put it in my bag just in case I'm having terrible cramps. And I also love to have tissue paper in my bag because, you know, you might need to use the toilet or something and you know you just need tissue paper or something in your bag so for you to make your period kit you're going to use a ziploc bag but if you have a fancy cute purse then you can use that but i don't have a fancy cute cute purse so i'm just going to use what i have so i have a ziploc bag and i'm going to use my cutting panties i'm going to put my cutting panties in my ziploc bag just one just in case I get stained, I can easily change my panties. So to that, I'm going to be adding one pad. You can add two pads if you want to. So I put in this moped pad. Guys, moped pad is one of the best pads that you can ever, ever use. And to my Ziploc bag, I'm going to be adding this pocket tissue. I have talked about this pocket tissue a lot on my channel. If you guys have watched my previous videos on hygiene, I always talk about this pocket tissue. And this one is Paloma pocket tissue. So I'm going to be adding this to my Ziploc bag. And I'll be adding my tissue paper to my Ziploc bag also. Just, you know, to have extra form of tissue. Okay, so to this i'm going to be adding some wipes i have an empty pack of wipes and i have a full new pack of wipes so what i do is that i take two or three wipes and put it in my empty pack of wipes because i can't take this big pack of wipe and put it in my bag it is going to occupy space so i just take two to three wipes and i put it in my empty wipe container or if you have a smaller wipe you can use that but I don't have a smaller wipe, so I just take two to three wipes and put it in my empty packet of wipes, and then I add it to my Ziploc bag. And there you go, you have your own period kit. Like, you can actually do this if you are going to work, if you are going to school, if you are a student, you can have this in your bag. I also love to have chewing gum in my bag and yeah guys this is it this is your own period kit and you can take it anywhere you are going to work or school thank you guys so much for watching this video today remember to give the video a huge thumbs up i'll see you guys in my next one bye